consistency. A morning routine, consistency. It's tricky. Not being home for a month kind of eliminates consistency. But we can do better. There's things I could do on the road. And I have to remember, this is the tricky bit about being on the road. If you're gonna be on the road a lot and you wanna keep making progress, it's not vacation. That's your life. You try to live it and maintain the rules that you have here. You need to get up, be active, have some water, stretch, and get the heart rate going. And that leads to me being able to think more, be clearer, take that time that I'm doing those things to kind of find some YouTube videos or find a podcast and be inspired. And then I want to draw, I want to concept and get some ideas down. <coughs> and then start the day with things like editing. I'm already ahead. The time's already done. I've already moved. <sighs> Just gotta make it happen. Have to fucking make it happen. So trying to keep things dialed while I'm home, so I'm gonna cook a little bit of lunch and a little bit of meat for the next couple days. In two days, or mostly just today. Seasoning for Ted Keller's, by the way, is the fucking best. Uh, really good dudes, good friend runs the company. Um, I've been using their stuff now for a couple years. I like the Dirty South one, go fucking figure. Check those guys out. Use code UMSO and you get free shipping on seasoning. So today I've got some Wagyu uh, ribeyes and Wagyu uh, strips. Not gonna take very long to cook. Got a few packages, let's see what we got. So new microphones, road links, the wireless uh, ones that I use for the podcast since uh, my shit was stolen. New Joby tripod. Yeah, now we're cooking with gas. I don't know what else I got. What the fuck is this? Air diffuser? Ah. Oh. That's shit for Ashley. That's Ashley stuff. Outsiders Club hat. Yes, another Outsiders Club t shirt. And your backpacks. Oh shit. Right? Fuck yeah. Casually here. Getting a little bit of work done. And who do I see? Oh, hey. How have you been? You been good? Chips? Dude is back. The old Jepster. Yeah. Be back out to deal with you in a second, bud. So really quick, gotta film uh, some B-roll stuff of the work we did with Stay Classy Meats. Yeah, so we're gonna fucking hook it up. And make it make it a go. Good stuff. Keep them spinning like the wheels on our whip. <laughs> the ones in the tube. I think we bring spinners back to the whip. They gotta be a bunch of cheap spinners we can find on Craigslist right now. 14s. Yeah, dude, it'd be dope. How about them spinner hubcaps they used to sell? Opposed to. True fact. Well, that was quick, easy shoot. Success. Now, work out. I don't want to.
that's it. That's a wrap. I'm fucking soaked. It's also very hot and humid here. Some deadlifts, some accessories, some, I don't know, dumbbell deadlifts. So the big trick with my knee so far, and it's still been the thing, is I'm trying to figure out how to do things that can stimulate my quad, get it moving without trashing the knee, which is really fucking tricky to do. But leg extensions done by like a million seem to work. Weighted vest squats. So that's, that's how this is gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do things like a ton of volume at no weight, like a shit ton of volume, like 200 reps, like more, maybe more, to try to get the quad fatigued, but the knee not pissed. So I did 150 leg extensions, 100 leg curls with the band and the weight, and then did 100 box squats and sets of 10, making sure that like I'm engaging and squeezing quads and glute at the top of the lift. All in all, Good day, got some shit done. Hell yeah. Today's Monday, leave for Iceland Thursday. Tomorrow, insurance adjuster is coming to check out my truck, sick. And then I get to try Wednesday to get my, shop, my truck in a shop to get it fixed. Hell yeah, we're gonna get it fixed. It's not gonna be a big deal. Smart. All right, that's it, that's your day. Nice being home for a second. For a second. Spread hate. Always party.